Hello everyone, welcome back. My name is Chris and this is Inktober, day 27. Today's prompt is music. Now I've been anticipating this one for a while and I've had this idea on the back burner. This idea of the lo-fi chill girl or, or whatever you may call her. I don't know, when I looked it up, I just typed in uh, lo-fi chill girl or lo-fi girl just to look at different samples of how I might go about mine. So I sort of went with this, uh, I guess, semi-goth aesthetic. I decided to do the shading on this one with a more manga feel to it. Where it's just flat blacks for whatever needs to have a solid darker color. And everything else is just left in white. I wasn't sure if I should have colored in the curtains that are in the background, which you'll see later. So I just left them blank because I didn't want to make the overall image too complex. I've been guilty of that with other runs and... I've been kind of experimenting myself with this Inktober, so none of them are perfect. But anyways, we only have four days left, everyone. This is kind of cool. It feels like every single day is going by quicker and quicker. I am now in full gear mode at finishing my holiday anthology, which I've been speaking about a lot in these videos, so I won't go into it much longer, but... I don't know, that's something I'm really excited for. Just kind of chilling here, watching my clip playthrough, seeing what mistakes I've made. I don't know how obvious it is in some of these cuts in my videos, but I do a lot of messing up where I accidentally smudge some ink without letting it dry. I don't know, there's a couple marks here that you'll be able to see later on, but it's fine. There's no need to cut and correct everything. Makes it feel more raw. Although I do have a little whiteout pen that anything that is a little too significant, I'll try to fix it somewhat. It's crazy, but here, here where I live in this city, it's it's gotten from hot to cold like that. It was just it was just out of nowhere. I've suddenly found myself just. Wearing jackets every single day, trying to keep warm at night. It's not too bad though, because in the end it is California after all. It's just that weird transition where you've been so used to the heat all summer. And pretty much most of the fall. That when winter comes around, it's a sudden change and your body's just not used to it. It has to acclimate. So, I've got that weird chill factor just going on through my body. I need to acclimate. Maybe the solution to that is not to wear warm clothes. Just force myself to embrace the coldness. I knew I mentioned in the previous day, day 26 of Inktober, that I would continue answering some of these questions. But I'm going to leave that for the next one. Just because I feel really chill and relaxed right now. and Just kind of saying what I want, filling up this space, and I'll see what I'll cut and leave in later. Although I will say one thing that's keeping me motivated these past few days is, uh, actually the past few weeks, it's a lot of nice comments from people, or direct messages especially from people on Twitter and Instagram. A lot of you uh, are really nice, and I appreciate that. Or some of you have asked me questions about how I went to, uh, how I go about promoting some commissions or line work, uh, certain stuff like that, some shading. And I know I'm not the best person. I'm sure there's a lot of people out there that can answer these questions better, but I try to help in any way I can. And I, I don't mind, you know, I'm not about keeping, uh, any secrets to myself to give myself a huge advantage. I hope that if I ever ask somebody else some questions, uh, I too would get an honest answer. So I should dish out what I expect to receive from others. I'll tell you what though, after this Inktober, I'm going to have to go through some of my files here and just start deleting a lot of them because I have a lot of copies and because I have a lot of copies and faulty files of just some of the artwork that I scanned or took pictures of. 
I just really got to get organized. That's the thing. If you're organized from the beginning, you will thank yourself later. And if you keep telling yourself, oh, I'll, I'll just organize it later, once it all clumps up, you're just asking for trouble. It's better to just take the extra minute or so to get organized. And that way you don't have to take hours later. You try to figure everything out and you'll have a headache. A lot of times you tell yourself, oh, I won't forget that. Yeah, I'll remember that. Why wouldn't I remember that? You will forget. <laughs> There's a lot you can forget over the course of even a few days let alone months and years. But enough about my mediocre organization skills. This is the end of the video. Only four more Inktober 2020 videos. I'll see you all on day 28. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Check out the rest of the Inktober 2020 playlist. There's one for every day of Inktober 2020. And I'll see you all next time. Have a great rest of your day. Bye.